So, if you may or may not know, I was recently in California. If you follow me on Instagram or Twitter, you might know, and it wasn't just some random vacation. I was actually looking at colleges because I'm a junior in high school, and this is kind of when college visits start, but it was amazing. I love California so much. I really hope that I can go to school there, but naturally, being me, as I was there for nine days, I went shopping. I don't really have an excuse for any of these things that I bought. I'm just a shopaholic. I'm going to have to clean out my closet very soon, but this stuff is going to hold me through spring and summer, I hope, so yes, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> the first thing I'm gonna start off with was my splurge purchase, I guess. I've been wanting Ray-Bans for the longest time, and I never really wore sunglasses a ton because I live in New York and it's not very sunny here but I got my license like in March or something and I always need sunglasses when I drive so I got some ray vans and I'm really excited so they came in a little case I got them from Nordstrom and I love Nordstrom so much I'm so mad that we don't have one here in New York but they are just the plain aviators and I got matte gold with brown lenses and I'll put them on for you I guess. I hope they look good because uh, they weren't cheap so let me know if you like them on me I guess. Um, yeah that's them. <laughs> okay so I'm gonna kind of jump around in this because I didn't get a lot of stuff from like one store so I'm gonna start off with this bathing suit that I got. It's two separate pieces but I really don't have very many bathing suits that I like so I first got this plain black bandeau top from H&M and I needed a plain black bandeau top. I love the style how it's like twisted in the front and it's just a tie back. Uh, it's really small, I have literally like no boobs so this is nice and this was only like $12 which is really great because bathing suits are ridiculously priced. I didn't plan on getting a bottom with that but I was in Forever 21 and I saw this bottom and it's really cute and as you're going to see by this haul I'm obsessed with sunflowers and daisies lately so it's this little bottom and it just has a ruffle on the top with some sunflowers I believe and they look like this and I think it's really cute and with the black top it's just a good match and these were only like $12 as well so good price for bathing suit. Okay moving on to the next bathing suit I got. This was the most amazing deal of my entire trip. I was in La Jolla which is near San Diego and there was a Roxy store and you could get a full bathing suit, a dress, and flip-flops for $99. And if you know Roxy, it's expensive. So this was an amazing, amazing deal. The bathing suit alone was $80. So, yes. Anyways, the top looks like this. It's kind of one of those, like, cup-style tops. Um, and it's really pretty. I don't exactly have the boobs to fill it. Like, just barely, you know. But it's so cute. It has, like... This kind of tropical, like, neon design thing. The straps come off as well if I want to take them off. And then the bottoms look like this. Oops. And I love this bathing suit so much. And I can also wear these bottoms with this top, so. Yes. The dress I got with this deal was alone $70. So as you're seeing, this deal was amazing. <laughs> but it looks like this. I'm also obsessed with tie-dye and maxi dresses. <laughs> so... It looks like this on top. It's a, a maxi dress and it's hot pink with some like peach and blue tie-dye down the front and then it goes all the way down like that. And then the back is um the back <laughs> is like crossed and then it's also the tie-dye all the way down. Final thing that I got with this deal were these white flip-flops and my white sandals are like grimy and disgusting now, so I figured I should get a new pair and they just look like this. They have braided white straps and they're really cute. Okay, moving on to the daisy theme. I went to a store called Pink Zone and I got this shirt and it was only like $5. So that's kind of why I got it. But it's a cropped daisy red tank top thing. Um, yeah, it looks like this and it's cute. I went to a store called Cotton On. You may or may not have heard of it. Um, I've been to a few of them, but they don't have any near me, and I just got these kind of high-waisted, like, acid wash light shorts, and I do have a good amount of shorts, but these ones fit me perfectly, and it's really hard for me to find the shorts that fit, because I'm, like, I don't know, weird 
like really small and shorts never fit right on me so and these ones fit really nice and I like them I like how they're ripped and they look really cute with this daisy crop top so I really like these I went to a store called angle or angel it's a-n-g-l and I really really liked it so first thing I got from there was this tie-dyed tank top yes it looks like this it's like black and taupey ish and it's really soft it feels kind of like Brandy Melville and yeah I just thought this was really cute and then also from angle I got this crocheted long sleeve shirt this is just like me to a T it's so so pretty and it's long sleeve the sleeves kind of bell out at the end also with that crochet detailing and it's so so pretty and it looks good with the tan and I love this. I went to a store called Triss and this was in a mall near me and it was like me in a store and this is how it's spelled and there's also a little um where they're located down here if you want to check it out but I got this tank top and it's like a bright red coral color which I love and it has some blue kind of floral on the front it's kind of wrinkly i apologize but it flows out at the bottom and then the back is like crossed and tied as you can see there and this store reminded me so much of free people they had some free people in there but most of it was just like their own brand so i love this shirt i also went shopping on melrose and i loved it so first thing i got were these shorts i am obsessed with these types of shorts now Ever since I got these ones and they're my go-to shorts now for summer because they're so comfortable and they're so cute they look like this uh, they're daisy print of course they have some little tassel pom-pom thingies on the ends and they're so so cute these with a shirt that I have to show you still um, are just so so cute so yeah I'm really excited about these and they feel like pajamas and they're so comfy <laughs> This is the top that goes amazing with those shorts. It's from Brandy Melville. It's like the only thing I got from Brandy Melville, so woo, go me. Um, but it's just this plain white tank because I've been needing a plain white tank for like 10 years now and I just never feel like buying it. So I got this one and with these shorts, it's like a dream. So I love this. There was one more shop on Melrose that I literally fell in love with. Like I can't express to you how amazing it is. First thing I got were another pair of those shorts and they look like this. They are amazing, they're floral, and then they also have those little pom-poms, and I just can't get over how cute they are, like, ah, I love them so much, so, just let that, let that sink in, how cute they are, but, yes, also with this white tank, it would be very cute, and I'm obsessed. Lastly, from that store, I got a romper, which is weird, because I normally really don't like rompers. But I'm starting to like them a lot and I saw that there was a lot of them in stores so I'm thinking maybe they're going to be like a trend or something. But I got this one and it's just kind of like a paisley florally print, like my favorite prints, you know. And it's a tank top romper, it has like this line down the front, I don't really know but then it just goes into shorts and it almost looks like a dress the way it is and they're super comfortable because you don't have to worry about your dress flying up because it's not a dress. And yeah, so here's a better look at it. Yeah, so I believe that store was called just the shop on Melrose or something. Uh, I'm not totally sure, but that's what I think it was. So I love that store and I need to like live there or something. <laughs> I went to Francesca's and I got a pair of earrings from my friend that I'm not going to show in case she watches this. And I also got this white tank top. It's really pretty. It's a chiffon kind of shoe, white tank, like halter maybe, I guess. And then the sides have like tribal stitching with like some shiny beads and stuff. So I thought this was really pretty and it'll also look good with a tan. So yes, things I got were actually college apparel because you guys might know I'm obsessed with college apparel. Even though I like dressing cute most of the time, I still love college clothes. So from my dream school, my number one choice at the moment, USC. I just got a v-neck that says USC Trojans on it and I enjoy it. Um, I was going to get a sweatshirt, but they didn't have any that I liked that fit me, so yes, I got this. And then from UCLA, I know I got the two rival schools, but I got a sweatshirt and this was just in the wash, so it's still kind of wet, but it's just a navy blue sweatshirt. It says UCLA in light blue and yellow on it, and I really like it. It's so cozy and comfy, 
and I'm going to wear this all the time. So those are the clothing items that I got from California. I had so much fun. I love it there. If any of you guys live there, I'm so jealous of you, but hopefully I will be be at Hopefully I will be back in about a year attending school there, so yes, we will see. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm really sorry that I haven't been posting a lot. I've been really busy. I apologize. I know some of you guys like hate me because of it, but I am a real person. I have a life outside of YouTube that I like to put effort into, so yes, I'm doing my best. But be sure to give this video a thumbs up and leave comments down below because I read all of your comments. And also follow me on Instagram because I post there all the time and it's super fun having followers. So that is Fiercely Tasha as well as my Twitter which is Fiercely Tasha. So yes, I love you guys. Bye.